Internet Power Supply. Switch on. Set up before testing. Choose the type based on the actual situation. The default unit is Newton per meter. Enable automatic alarm. Return to the testing interface. Place the sample in the testing position. Adjusting the width through a knob. Stabilize the sample and tighten it to secure it. Then create the clear. Screw the bottle cap. We can test screw multiple samples in this way. Then click save. Save once per every screw. By querying, you can see the test data. Click print to directly print the test results. Now let's switch to the other mode opening the bottle cap. before testing. Then enter the setting interface and change to open. Back to the test interface. Click clear again. Twist off the bottle cap. You can see the current value 0.721 on the screen. We can test multiple samples in the same mode. Save once after each test. Then you can check the test data. After that, directly print the data. Next is calibration. First, remove the four fixing rods. Enter calibration. Stand up the instrument. Measure the distance from the center point to the edge with a ruler. The length is 12 centimeters. This is a weight of 200 grams. Gravity is 1.96, torque is 0 0.235. Click clear. Hand the weight on. the way suspend and stationary. The gravity value should be 0 0.235. But it's only 0 0.219. Create target top and input 0 0.235. Opening force correction completed. Next, calibrate the locking force. Clear first. Hand the weight on the right side. 
keep the weight suspended and stationary. The target torque should be negative 0.35. Input negative 0.35. 